D Note, man, we back in the boxing world. Back with another boxing video, man. Y'all like, comment, and subscribe for me, man. Everything greatly appreciated. We on the road to 500, then on the road to 1K. But yeah, we got a lot of drama brewing up in the 135 pound, 140 pound division. We got a lot, man. I'm just gonna put all the videos, all the sound bites. <laughs> I'm gonna add them to the video right here. Was trying to replace you, right? What, what was your thoughts about that when Shakur Stevenson was trying to replace you? I don't know. He's just a bitch looking for a payday. Fuck you. He said he would stand in front of me all night. Please, please, please fucking do that. I'm gonna knock your fucking weird ass out, bro. This dude had, bro. I remember a time in the fucking amateurs. We fucking pants him and there were shit stains on his underwear. No cap. Oh my god, <laughs> bro. Everybody knows that too. Everybody fucking knows that. <laughs> I mean, hey, yo, yo, you're just a mess. Hey, Ryan, Ryan, you know it's recording like that, bro. He just gonna run, bro. But Abdul Wahid coming at me, bro. Basically, Javante, but his new name is Abdul Wahid, so I'm gonna try to respect his new name. He literally was like, "Oh, buddy's gonna get knocked out again." Uh, with the right hand or with some shit. I'm like, bro, what is your problem? We ain't even worried about you, bro. Fight me at 140. He got a problem with me for some reason. Post-fight press conference. I thought you guys were cool after that, you know? Bro, he literally gave me his number. That shit was a fake number. Huh. That, See, that's some weird, weird shit. Name. That's weird. That's some weird shit, bro. Who gives you a fake-ass number? Will you fight me next? If I don't get the rematch for Tank, I will do it. You got my word. You have so my word. You said, you said, you said, if what? I don't get the rematch with Tank, you have my word, we'll fight. Shakur, you going to. Okay, cool. That, Does that work? That's all I want to hear. You got my bro. word. Yeah, that's all I want to hear. For bro. sure. That's and, all I want to hear. If you were right here, I, I want to fight you, bro. But yeah, would y'all want to see the Ryan versus Shakur fight or Ryan and Tank rematch after the Devin fight? Does Ryan have to win versus Devin to get either one of these fights, or would y'all still be interested in it, even if he loses? I feel like if he loses to Devin, Tank gotta just fight Devin, man. <laughs> Tank just, if he gonna go up to 140, he gotta fight Devin. But if he stay at 35, then he gotta fight Shakur, man. Or you gotta fight one of them guys. But yeah, which I wanna see a Shakur Ryan fight at 140. I think it wouldn't be no problem for Shakur to move up to, um, to 140. That'd be a good fight. But would I wanna see if he loses to Devin? I don't know, man. I feel like he gotta win. Versus Devin for either one of these fights to make sense. Because, like, if you lose this fight, you just need to duck off for a little bit. <laughs> fight some lesser competition. Keep it moving, man. Because you you're not good enough to beat the top guys. Ain't nothing wrong with that, though, man. You done made a lot of money in boxing. Just might not be an A-level fighter, you know what I'm saying? Might be a B-level. Like, that's cool. Like, you got them quick hands, power. Hey, you got to put in the youth, man. You got to beat Devin. Got to beat Devin for these fights to make sense for me. But I don't know what everybody else thinking. Are these fights y'all even want to see? Y'all asking for these fights? <laughs> I think Shakur might just want a little payday, man. He trying to get in on the money, too. <laughs> Said Tank done got some. Dev done got some. Trying to get some next. But, yeah, it makes sense, man. Would y'all want to see that fight? Ryan versus Shakur or Ryan versus Tank? Which one would y'all rather see? How would they go? I think Tank wins by knockout, man. I think he'll put Ryan to sleep again. I ain't gonna lie. Like, really put him to sleep this time, though. <laughs> not no quitting. Not no none of that. You know, really put him to sleep this time. Yeah, y'all seen Tank responding to the little training video. Ryan, Ryan training. Hitting the bags all quick and everything. <laughs> he said, in a brick hand over right. And he goes to sleep. I think he'll go to sleep again if he fights Tank again. I think the rematch will end in another knockout. <laughs> then if he fights Shakur, I think um I think Shakur went by UD. I think Shakur went by UD unless Ryan just catch him with one of them punches. But I don't think so, man. Shakur defense is too good. He know how to slip punches too good. Boxing IQ is just too high. You know what punch to throw at what time. Like Shakur one of them ones, man. People say he's scared of power, but we don't know, man. Was he hurt or is he just scared of power? We got to see, man, his next couple fights. He got to come back hard, man. You say he going to do his next opponent bad. 
just because the fans, <laughs> they've been doubting him. But yeah, man, y'all let me know in the comments if y'all would even want to see any of these fights. Do y'all care about the drama or y'all just ready for the Ryan Devin fight? Y'all gonna buy that fight? Or has Ryan ruined the fight for y'all, man? He kind of ruined it for me, but I'm gonna still watch it. Still buy it, most likely. So yeah. But yeah, man, I ain't gonna talk too long, man. It's just a little drama cooking up. No no fights happening, nothing like that yet. So, But just a possibility. Yeah, y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Hey, man, everything greatly appreciated.